Hi, I'm Luke McQuarrie, and I play guitar here in Nashville, Tennessee. And how long have you been playing guitar? Seven years. Seven years. Yep. And how old are you now? I'm 18. First impression though was just how easy it was to play. You know, it just so simple to play and of course my guitar I hadn't had it refretted or nothing I've been wore it out you know so getting a guitar that was just easy to play again it just it's just so simple you know and really light really lightweight I love that about it from the get go in the dark the dark tin and neck I love that How about the feel of the neck and, and the feel of the I cracks? I like the anything? feel of it. You know, it's not it's not too big and it's not too small. And you know, it just it just plays so good. It's so smooth. It just you know it bends. You don't ever fret out or nothing like that. That's what I love about it. Hey, I'm Michael Britt from Lone Star. Well, I, I was aware of their effects pedals for years. I had an RC booster, an AC booster, and, and uh, I didn't really realize that the guitar company was the same thing, but I saw somebody playing one and it's like, that's just got a gorgeous neck and I'm a sucker for really pretty woods. So I went and picked up my exotic Strat. I've loved these guitars. So I, once I found out they're making a telly, I was like, I jumped right on it and got one of the first ones. I love vintage gear. I love, like I'm playing through a vintage Fender, and I love vintage looking gear. But I also, I've had a lot of, I've had some vintage gear, and the playability is just, you know, you sacrifice a little bit. And I've had Tom Anderson guitars for so many years, and they play so immaculately that I'm just so used to modern feeling, really well-made boutique guitars. So that's the cool thing about the exotics, is they look like vintage instruments, and they sound like vintage instruments, but the playability and the craftsmanship is so new and modern and stable that I don't have to worry about it on the road. It's, they stay in tune, there's not any dead frets, there's, you know, the action is great, the necks feel great. As soon as you start playing it, you just don't want to put it down, it just feels good. I think they're vintage sounding, but they actually have a lot of body. Some of the vintage sounding pickups that I've heard are, are a little bright, but these, to me, they have a vintage sound, but they've got a full body. There's, they're, they're not thin, they're not bright, they don't ice pick you, they are just... And normally, I'm a pickup swapper. I will take pickups out. I'll swap pickups till I get it sound just like I want. I have never wanted to even take these out of the guitar. When you look down and you see this beautiful flame on the neck, it's like, it's a nice guitar. And then you play it. It's just, I don't know. I don't know what else I would want from it. This is a perfect, because it's modern and vintage all at the same time. Hi, I'm Jack Roosh. I'm from Nashville, Tennessee. Well, I mean, even before I got it, when I just played it at NAMM, the neck shape and the feel of the neck was the first thing, and also the weight. It's so light. But really, the neck profile is just, it's really perfect. So that was my first initial impression was like, wow, I can really, I get really dig the feel of this guitar. Once I got it and started playing it, all the little details that kind of make up the guitar, sort of just every, everything, the hardware, 
it, it just plays so easy. Living in Nashville, being a guitar player for hire, I get called for country gigs and pop country gigs and Americana stuff, everything from singer-songwriter things where I might not play any solos, I'm just playing kind of textural stuff, to stuff where I'm really rocking out. And it, it does, it works really well. Um, the pickups are not too noisy and because they're very full sounding, you can use it with a real high gain sound and it works really well. Um, and because it stays in tune and it intonates so well, you can really play kind of anything you want. So with this guitar, I feel like I don't have to think about it at all. I just know it's going to work. I know it's going to stay in tune. I can switch between the pickups and I know everything's going to sound good. So it, it really just takes the, a load off your your mind having to worry about any of this stuff. Mm -hmm. 